Coming up on today's show, we have this week's Student of the Week, and it's time to start considering what courses you'll be taking next year. Stay tuned, you're watching Roar TV. Good morning, Oviedo. I'm Julia Hoffman. And I'm Tyler Wampole. Today is Tuesday, January 21st, 2020. Hope everyone had an amazing long weekend. And are dressed warm for the cold week ahead. We're not going to be doing a Tele-OHS question of the week this week, as we will not have a broadcast on Thursday or Friday due to the mental health coursework and the modified bell schedule. Let's go ahead and get the show started. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. There will be a brief National Athletic Honor Society meeting today at 225 in Coach Waters room 8-202. The meeting is for juniors and seniors only interested in joining NAHS who have a 3.5 or higher weighted GPA and play an FHSAA sanctioned sport. The meeting will be less than five minutes. We will go over what the National Athletic Honor Society is, as well as discuss leadership openings and the opening of the Oviedo High School chapter of this organization. Oviedo High School will be co-hosting the annual Black History Show on February 22nd. We're looking for any interested students who would like to showcase their talents. If you're interested, please see Mr. Morgan in the front office. If you are interested in playing tennis, tryouts will begin today after school at the tennis courts by Building 5. Arrive by 2.40 p.m. to begin warming up and bring your racket, athletic clothes, water, and a white card to be ready to play. If you have any questions, please see Coach Furiosi in room 12-018. Decision Day at Seminole State College will be held on a Friday, February 14th. Spend the day learning everything you need to know about Seminole State. Transportation and lunch will be provided. You'll even have the chance to win some great prizes. Attention Seniors OHS Project Grad is creating your senior class shirt. If you would like to create a design for this year's shirt, all submissions can be sent to webmaster.ohsabc at gmail.com by midnight February 20th. Make sure to include your name and student ID in the submission. Your design must be in a PDF or JPEG format. Water polo tryouts are today at the Oviedo Aquatic Center. Anyone with a white card is welcome to try out. Thursday and Friday this week, January 23rd and 24th, Oviedo High School will be on a modified block schedule. Here's a look at Thursday's bell schedule. It's not a bad idea to snap a picture so you'll remember. You will only attend 1st, 3rd, 5th, and 7th period on Thursday. Note that 3rd period will be much longer to accommodate the required mental health coursework. Then on Friday, you will attend 2nd, 3rd, 4th, 5th, and 6th. Please take a look at the times. And now it's time for this week's Student of the Week. Good morning, Oviedo High School. It's Dr. Daniel, and today I have Shauna Rogers with me. Shauna is our state champion in bowling, and she was just named the 2019 Miss Bowling from Dairy Farmers. Congratulations, Shauna. We're very proud of you. Thank you.
Good morning, Lions. This morning, we're going to review our fire alarm evacuation procedures. Remember, the fire alarm sounds, don't panic. Instead, all students shall assemble in the classroom near the door. Your teacher will take account of how many people are gathered at this assembly point and note who may be missing. The teacher will review with you the primary evacuation route and the alternate route. Once everyone is assembled and briefed, your teacher will advise the group when to begin the orderly evacuation and proceed to your designated area. Recognize that in lieu of exiting for fire, you may be directed to take other actions such as a code yellow or red procedure. Remember, if your primary fire exit route is inaccessible, take your identified alternative route. Once at your designated area, stay there and stay with your group. Once the evacuation has occurred, don't re-enter the building until the fire department and school officials have given the all clear to do so. It is important to remember during these events, calmness counts. Have a great day. That's all we have for you today, Oviedo. Teachers, this is the day you need to play the course registration video. The video is sitting in the Roar TV folder on the shared drive and has been uploaded to the Oviedo Broadcast YouTube channel. Please be sure to play it after this broadcast. Have a terrific Tuesday, everybody. And as always, Go, go Lions! Lions.